We uh, now have a guest with us from um, HollywoodLife.com with the inside scoop. Please welcome Chloe Malas. <laughs> Chloe, I'm so glad that you're here. Now, I saw this on the internet, and um, you know, we have more information. Which two celebrities were hooking up in the bathroom in the club? All right, it's Chris Brown and Rihanna. <laughs> You know, they were broken up for a few years, and now they are back together. So uh, they're both in New York City right now, and I was just told not only did they make out and hook up at the Griffin Monday night in New York. And there were a, a lot of celebrities there. There were a lot of celebrities in the VIP there, area. In the VIP area. They had tables right next to each yes. other. I've just learned that Chris Brown bought Rihanna 10 bottles of Dom Perignon that night. Now, not only were there security guards blocking the bathroom door yes. so that they could hook up I, for a little bit. Because I heard that Rihanna went in first. She did. Then and he then, followed in. Mm -hmm. Then he left. Uh -huh. And then she came out looking a little disheveled, disheveled a few minutes later. Now. <laughs> now, here's the thing, though. So, she's staying at one hotel in New York. He's staying at another hotel in New York. And he was spotted leaving her hotel room or her hotel yesterday afternoon. So, it looks as though they spent the entire day together. They were partying till about 4 a.m. But this just in, Wendy. Last night, these two were partying again at One Oak, and now guess who is now in town? Chris Brown's on and off girlfriend, Carucci. She doesn't care. She just got in town. She doesn't so, care. He's disrespected her so many times. Well, Girl, so you might as well keep is, it moving. question is, Wendy, does Carucci know about Chris Brown and Rihanna? So everybody can't understand why should we be, why is Carucci willing to stay with Chris while he's hooking up with Rihanna? She needs to come up. We don't know that she's in school. We don't know what kind of money she has or doesn't right. have. She needs a fast come up. All right, so Chris Brown, Rihanna, Carucci, they are all here in New York right now as we speak. And we don't know when Rihanna's leaving or when Chris Brown is leaving or why Carucci is here. But this is just getting really dramatic. I <laughs> love that story, Chloe. OK, next, let's talk about Kathy Wachili's new face from Jersey Housewives. <laughs> yes. Yes, okay, so she got some plastic surgery. I spoke to her on the phone yesterday for a while, told her I was coming to speak to you, yes. and she has a message. Okay. So even though she got a nose job and she got her lips plumped up a little bit, she doesn't believe that women should be getting plastic surgery. She says only enhance what you have. So if you want to look like that's somebody else, say. that's not what you should do. Just, just enhance what you have. But she says that she broke her nose twice while oh. playing sports with Rosie growing mm -hmm. up and that she's always wanted to get rid of the bump in her nose and just look like what she did look like in high school. This is okay? like all the celebrities, I have a deviated septum. <laughs> she says she my... has that too. Of course. Okay, because she says that she was snoring a lot. Anyway, her husband didn't want her to get a nose job, but her family's really happy. But here's the other thing, her lips, she got them done only 10 days before the reunion show. Uh -huh. And it was while she was getting a facial, she said, what would it take to play? these up a little bit yes and they said let's just do it right now so that's why she says they looked so big yeah because it was only done about a week before yeah and, and that that was not premeditated she didn't get anything done to her jawline uh -uh. no juvederm rest she says no okay she says okay. no uh -uh. well and i love the center part and i love the lighter hair i mean you're, Look, you're still she pretty looks really good yeah she's a very pretty woman yeah She's a very pretty woman. All right, now let's talk about Rob Pattinson and Kristen Stewart. Right, are they really back together? Yes, they are working things out. This is another couple, kind of like Chris Brown and Rihanna. You never really know, are they together one day, not together the next? But Rob and Kristen are about to embark on Breaking Dawn Part 2 oh. promotion. So they're about to be oh. touring the entire world together promoting this movie. It comes out November 18th. Now, these two have been spotted out together. Hollywood Life can confirm at Soho House the other night with some friends. Mm -hmm. um, um, but Rob has been partying a little bit on his own, too. But here's the thing. Kristen wants to work things out with Rob so badly that there are reports that she has given him access to her email, her phone, It's only everything. right. It's only right. He's so not the one who cheated. So that she can say, listen, I'm not cheating on you anymore. Yeah. And he's supposedly really fragile and really broken. But she's out wearing his clothes, wearing the jewelry that he bought Does her. he have access to both of her phones? <laughs> That's all I'm saying. Chloe, I love your report. Thank you so much. Chloe, everybody, for more juicy stories, go to HollywoodLife.com. Up next, Kiki's here. <laughs>